I went down to Offord, and have a look at that. That was, well, completely useless. The river was literally just under the banks, so that won't fish, very unlikely. Um, so after driving around most of Cambridgeshire, I ended up back, well, at my local brook, because nothing else looks fishable. I had to look at quite a few areas, but they're just all still chocolate brown and it's well high. It's, they just won't fish well. So. I thought, oh, well, should I go to a pool? And I thought, I don't really want to go to another pool because I've done so many pools lately. Although there is a, a little wild gravel pit that I might fish. They've got wild carp in it, so I could have a go. I might try that tomorrow, actually. Um, but anyway, just to get some sort of content, I'm probably going to fish my local brook again. And hopefully some big roach will show up. It's running, and, uh, it's running a little bit, but... But um, it's not, you know, it's slightly coloured, which might be good. It's got a bit of, got a bit of a flow on it, and it's slightly coloured, so it could be good. Well, come down to the brook, as I said I would. <laughs> this is the only place that seems to be fishable right now. I've, um, I've set it up just so you can see the tip. You should be able to see that there. Hopefully. <clears throat> Let's try a maggot feeder to start off with. Um, someone's lost a golf rolly in the brook, which is interesting. It's right beneath the rod at the moment. There we go. Well, that is being attacked. It doesn't look like it's being attacked by anything big. <laughs> well, here we go, original one. Yay! Hey, actually, I think it's a. What have we got here? Oh, we've got a nice rud. <laughs> and here he is, fish number one. Hand sized rud. <laughs> Very <laughs> it's still really lively. <laughs> there we go. Nice hand sized rud. This is a much better fish. Oh, yes. <laughs> This is why I fish the brook. I will need the net for this one. Oh, he's, oh, he's come off. Oh no. Okay, that was um that was actually a rud of about a pound easily. Uh, and they've done that, they always do that. Straight into the nearby bloody snags. And just through the hook. Oh that was a cracking fish, that was. It really was. Oh what a shame. Nice fishing, don't I? That was a beauty. Ooh, he says. <laughs> oh, and that one. Oh, that one's come off as well. Okay. That's two fish that's come off in a row now. That wasn't a bad fish either. Right. Time to change the hook. I'm not going to mess around with that anymore. That's two fish off. Time for this hook to go. Go on then. Take the worm. Go on. Go on. That's it. You're on that. Oh yes. Oh, this is a good fish. Finally. Ooh, he's trying to get onto the brolly. Ooh. I'm gonna swing you in, mate, because you're mad. Oh, that went crazy. <laughs> Tried to get under the brolly. There's a cracking roach as well. What a lovely fish. All right. I've had something half decent. <laughs> there we go. Lovely roach. In the brook again. Nice fish that. <laughs> it fought like mad. I think you might have picked it up because I dropped the camera down on the brook. So you might have just seen it. Headed for the brolly that's in the water and then went round that and tried to get into another snack. 
only a little fish but they, they really do fight well it's a nice size roach it's chunky and it's quite heavy oh yeah lovely fish that can't complain at all not bad at all right let's um get him back in the rain Always get a bite when I'm doing something. <laughs> Typical. Yeah, that feels a that feels a really good fish. <laughs> Same as. <laughs> no, it's not bad. It's not bad. Another nice rope. That's from a completely different area. Another nice fish. <coughs> Stunner <Stunnocky>. kid. <laughs> or at least that hook actually doing the job. Not very good at all. Yeah, another nice roach. There you go. Perfect condition. Actually, no, he's something's at his oh, something's at his tail look. That's interesting. That is interesting. Wonder what bit his tail in this brook. That's very interesting. I have seen some perch in it. Well, I caught some perch last year. Um, but they weren't that big. Not big enough to attack him anyway. <laughs> You're going to get wet. I am. <laughs> Who cares, eh? I ain't bothered. Good luck. <laughs> Thanks. A little light round. Oh, oh, he's in a snag. He's in a snag. Oh, he's out of the snag. Another nice roach. Just about swimmable. Crikey. It's a lovely fish, that is. He's a bit of an old bruiser, he is. Good size fish, though. Tell you what, these are the sort of fish you want in a match. This sort of stamp. Right, he's very lively. I'm trying to hold him one hand at the moment. Yeah, another one. Another nice chunky roach. They are chunky as well. Look how fat he is. Nice fish. He's got that black spot thing going on. Some of them have on it, some haven't. Yeah, it's a nice fish. Good stamp. Give you a good scrap for the size as well. If you're on light tackle, I bet they're really good. I'm kind of light tackle today, but but not proper light tackle. Yeah. All right, he is. Get it back. So, yes, this is the new feature to fish towards in the brook. A sunken brolly. That's awesome. I stayed a little bit longer, even though I'm soaked. I uh, had another nice roach, smaller than the other. I'm gonna have to cut that session a bit short because uh, it's just raining and the camera's getting soaked and it stopped working properly, so it's not really worth it. But I will find out, I'll, I'll figure a way out of getting a hood for it. I might use a bait hood or something over it. But anyway, uh, that's that. <laughs> the end of a, another not bad trip. I lost a very good fish though, it was a shame. But, Anyway, um, thanks for watching, like, subscribe, all that stuff, and happy angling.